30 seconds to go. Get up and get away from the trap. From Rainbow Theory Point. It's a rainbow shot also from Fabiosa. That's not the initial feature. I think the score is uh, somewhat misleading. Even though it turned out to be a rout in the favor of the Kushka Resonizers, let's not forget that this was a 10-point ball game for most of the uh, most of the game. And Kidabin also played exceptionally well. He's been consistent. Could be a Magnolia Ice Cream best player of the game candidate. Three-point shot by Eddie Blankenstein. And also getting his nine points. A lot of prolific players from Base Again, Dineray Bates, shooting with grace. A rainbow shot, 50 points, 4.5 seconds. Bob Sadonado going up, scoring his 29th point, 2.2 seconds. The crowd is almost there in the floor. As a matter of fact, they're beginning to lift Coach Tommy Manopo. And the air horn officially ends the fifth and last game in this best of five series so officially we find the score 139 for Chris Barretonizers the champion in the second conference beating Great Taste Coffee who showed that they have the capability to balance at 40 for championship games losing by 19 points and this fourth quarter was won by Chris they fired 42 points to Great Taste Coffee's 35 a lot of fans being happy, and these are the followers of the Redmanizers. <laughs> Amazing. On the floor right now, the fans of the Redmanizers putting up Billy Ray Bates on the shoulders, and he removed his headband. A lot of smiles from the Redmanizers. They've been working hard towards this, and they injected a new element from Tommy Monotok, defense. Defense is the name of it. We'd like also to congratulate the uh, Great Taste team, great effort. Like Tommy said, both of the teams played so well. If they could really uh, deserve it, both of them really deserve the championships. They played a very good game. 139 points, though, for Chris, by 120 for Great Taste. It was almost unbelievable to believe, because it's almost impossible to believe that you know, a championship a game would end this way. Billy Ray Bates, big hero well, there, he mm -hmm. has to really commend the game of Akitabe, Philip Cesar, and also Padim Israel in this ball game. Right now, ladies and gentlemen, we have uh, beside us, and we are very glad that he can spend a little time with us, the coach, the winningest coach this year, Coach of Chris for Redmanizers, Tommy Monopo. And we would like to ask Tommy, here is the first question. At what point of the game did you feel that you had it under your belt? Well, I felt after the first half, after we limited them to 49 points, that we had the game under control. In effect, it was a low scoring game. Uh, all their shots were hard earned. There were no easy shots for them. And whenever you limit great place to 49 points in the first half, you are controlling the game, in effect. And this is what we have. Now, of course, the problem of Billy Ray Bates in foul trouble, we had to adjust a little bit. I had to put Cesar on him. But Bates had to keep scoring, in effect. Their local players could not contain uh, Bates. Because I felt it was only Norman Black who could do a decent job, but they never put Norman Black on, on base. You know? A local player can never control uh, Billy Ray Bates, basically. Now, Tommy, did you really have difficulty in putting a new quality with the Red Bananas? And I'm talking about defense. Well, they, they never even knew the word defense before I got there. And I think uh, tonight's game was sort of the epitome of what I had been preaching all along. That if you were going to be great base, it would have to be defensively. And by the very fact, as I said, that we limited them to 49 points in the first half, it was already an, an initial step. Of course, they still scored 120, but this also showed the offensive power of Christoph, which they were able to score 139. But their 120 was already scored very loosely in the last two minutes of the game. If we defended well in the last three minutes, they would not have reached 115, I felt, tonight. Yes, that's true, because they were only 85 points.